What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. I've got the screen down because I'm not exactly appropriate um, to be on screen right now. Um, so it'll stay down the whole time just to let you know. Um, it's going to suck talking to the top, top of the screen, but um, I can't put it up right now. Um, but I felt guided to do this reading. I wasn't going to do one today, but I am going to do it because I got a channel message in, so I'm going to do it. Hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Um, uh, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. We're 12,175 subscribers right now, so thanks so much for all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess to Row 5. The link's in the description box below if you'd like to donate. Okay, so... Um, the channel message I received, I just received it, so I, I'm going to deliver it. Um, like I said, I can't put the screen up right now. Um, but the channel message I received was, um, the wheel is about to start moving very fast, fast, fast for many people soon. Um, it's either going to move in a positive way or a negative way. Um, some people are about to get unexpected um, negative communication from the IRS soon. I heard that in there. And some people are about to get an unex, um, unexpected knock on the door from the police. And some people are going to get a call from an investigator. Police is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. That's a plethora of different things. So only you know your story, not anybody else. Uh, ooh, the wheel is about to start moving fast, fast, fast. So fast, 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 fast. Um, what, uh, some in a positive way, some in a neg negative way. So you really have to plug it in your own life, how it resonates uh, for you. But I did hear three different things in there. Um, I heard some people are going to get unexpected negative communication from the IRS. So internal revenue service. So however that resonates, it's some kind of negative communication. Uh, obviously not communication these people want from the IRS. Um, some people are about to get a knock on the door. Uh, I heard arrested from the uh, arrested by the police, so they're about to get arrested by the police. Um, and some people are about to get unexpected, um, not unexpected, get phone call communication from an investigator, and then I heard police. So I think you're helping an investigation with the police, or you're about to, if you resonate in category number three. So. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So you really have to plug it in your own life, how it resonates. And by the way, today is the last day to file if you don't need an extension, if you live in the United States um, or you're filing in the United States. Uh, April 18th is the end of tax day uh, for 2022 today. So just to let everybody know, um, I had to do mine today too. So um, I understand. But um, so yeah. So three different categories. It could be you plugging into these categories or somebody you're connected to, however that resonates. Her try again. I got creation. I heard try again. Spirit messages you have for Sucky. Okay. We got Vision Quest Upright, Child Reverse, Courtship Upright. Number 18 or 4 could be very significant numbers in one's life. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible age of child or of a child of you or somebody you're connected to. And also number 10 to uh, completions, completions of cycles. Um, and that could be where the wheels about to start moving very fast. Completion of the cycles, new cycle begin, cycle moving fast. Or wrapping up the cycles, completing the cycle. So you plug it in how it resonates. But um, number four, 18 or 10 could be very significant numbers in one's life. However that resonates in one's life. Let me see if I hear anything.
Someone is going to try to swoop in and be a hero. A knight in shining armor to a to a mother, single mother. Does not have currently have full custody of her children right now. It's about to backfire in a huge way. She's not interested. She wants her children back. Oh my lord. Woo. So you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody think, okay, if this resonates for you, you currently don't have full custody of your children right now. Now you might have, you know, um, visitation rights or something like that, but you don't have, or you might not have any rights at all, how that resonates, but you don't have full custody of child or children right now. You either have visitation or no rights, however that resonates. But somebody sees you don't. So they're going to swoop in. It sounds like they want a relationship with you. They want to be your knight in shining armor. They want to save the day. I wish you could see my face because I think this is freaking ridiculous. But I heard you're not interested. You're not interested. You just want your kids back. You just want your kids back. You don't want no relationship. You don't want no booty. You don't want no nookie. You don't want anybody trying to save you. You want your kids back. That's what I heard. Loud and proud. Um, and that could be the journey reversed too. It's cycles are stuck for you right now, or you feel they are, because you want your damn kids back. You don't want to, whoever you are, you're a single mother. So you are not, you don't have a partner. You don't have, they want courtship with you, but you don't want courtship. You want courtship reversed. You want your kids back. Your child reversed right now. You want child upright. But they're looking, Vision Quest, for a relationship with you because you don't have full custody right now. I think some of these people planned it that way, and I'm just being serious. I think they planned it that way. I think they planned to get your child or children taken away from you so they would swoop in and be the knight in shining armor. And I'm just being for real, for real about that. I think they, exact, they freaking planned it that way. They wanted to leave you stuck. They wanted to leave you stuck. Um... And they wanted, I think they wanted you to get so depressed that you'd come running to them, but that hasn't happened. So now they're going to come to you. But I heard you're not interested. So I think they're about to get a tower. And I'm just being serious about that. And Aquarius is getting a huge wake up call. Huge. I heard an Aquarius is getting a huge wake up call. Huge. So whoever you are, Aquarius, um, I don't know if you're planning on trying to do this to somebody or you know somebody that's going to try to do this to somebody. Um, it could be a feminine energy trying to swoop in for a homosexual relationship or it could be masculine trying to swoop in for a heterosexual relationship. I don't know. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But I do think it was planned this way. I do. I think they wanted you to be depressed. I think they wanted you to come running after their ass, but you haven't done that. So now they're going to try to come running to you. But I heard you're not interested. You're not freaking interested. And I don't blame you. I do not blame you, whoever this is for. Not one damn bit. Because your children should be, should be way more important than any penis or vagina out there. Period. Freaking bar none. And that's just the truth. Now, a lot of so-called parents don't see it that way. They always put their relationship over their damn kids. I see it happen way too many damn times in society. But I think it's disgusting. I think it's freaking disgusting is what that is. And whoever does that, they need to have their priorities set in check. And I'm just being serious. But whoever you are, you have your priorities in check. Fully freaking in check. You hold tight because many positive things are about to come to you. Okay, I heard you hold tight because many positive things are about to come to you. So you plug it in your own life, how it resonates, um, whoever you are. You're a feminine energy. Um, you're a femme energy. You have children. You're a single mother, I heard. So I heard you hold tight because many positive things are going to come to you. But who are, it's somebody from your past, whoever it is, uh, fem energy, single mother. It is somebody from your past. You can be any sign. I didn't hear a sign. But it's somebody from your past. I think they planned this shit. They have been watching you, Vision Quest. They have been watching your ass. In some shape, form, or fashion, they've been watching you. And I'm serious about that. People need to learn to get the damn clue and move the hell on. And I'm just being serious.
You have treated this person like trash in the past. How do you ever expect it to turn around? Oh my God. Whoa. I heard you treated this person like trash. How do you ever expect it to turn around? That's what I just heard. So whoever you are, person that's going to try to swoop in and be the knight in shining armor here, you're about to get a rude ass awakening. I think for a lot, you might be masculine energies. For some, you might be homosexual femme energies um, trying to swoop in here. But um, our, you're, you're going to get a rude ass awakening if you attempt to do this. I'm just letting you know. You're about to get a rude ass awakening. This feminine energy is not freaking interested. People need to leave people the hell alone. And that's just the truth. The freaking truth. And I heard you could, were completely disrespectful to this person in the past. So why would they ever expect you to change your crazy ways or change your ways? I mean, just saying, just saying. What are we at on time? 11 minutes. Let me see if I hear anything else. But some kind of Aquarius is getting a huge wake-up call. Masculine or feminine Aquarius, whoever you are, Aquarius, to this situation. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't. All right. Well, I love you guys. I'm getting off of here. I can't put the screen up anymore. Love y'all. Namaste.